<laughs> what was advertised as the next big thing but then just vanished? Google Plus they made it as this whole new social media thing and it flopped hard. HD DVD, Blu-ray won over, then streaming killed it all. Microsoft Surface, not the tablet, was supposed to be some wave of the future type of concept, imagine Minority Report, alas, I don't think it ever left the concept stage. Take a peek, https forward slash forward slash www.youtube.com watch, v equals 6 vfpvyyqzhs. 3D movies, over and over again it appears then vanishes because it's always been a bit poop. Mini discs which were late 90s early 2000s. That tiny CD in the first Men in Black movie, never came to fruition. Ingage, a phone, and and a video game system, too bad you had to remove the battery whenever you wanted to change games. The Segway. NFTs. Shitcorns of various stripes and sorts. Airship moorings at the Empire State Building. Zip drives. 100 megabit storage on a single floppy disk. What was not to like? This is going back almost 30 years now, but me and a mate started working for ourselves when they were the new big thing, I was doing web design and my mate was doing graphic design, and we did a lot of work together, so we both got a zip drive so we could pre-raw artwork between each other. This was back in the days of dial-up internet, if you're wondering why we didn't just use FTP or email. 9 times out of 10, my drive wouldn't read discs written by his drive, and vice versa, never got to the bottom of it, we both got replacement drives, still the same thing, all this time later, I'd still love to know if anyone had any luck at all using them this way. They were great for the time when it actually worked, but we had nothing but trouble with them, ended up just using them as backup devices, but they rapidly became redundant once writable CDS became affordable. Although, to be fair, they could be a bit hit and miss too in the early days. Digital audio tapes, DATs. They were tiny tape cassettes that reported to have better sound quality than CDS. They came out just after CDS became huge around 1987, people were speculating that it was a waste of money buying CDS because DATs were going to be the next big thing this chatter lasted well into the early 90s. By about 1994, it became clear that no one was interested in DATs. I wanna say 3D TVs but I didn't know a single person who owned one. Mini disc, I had a mini disc Walkman and deck and used it for two years or so, but then MP3 players showed up and it became kind of useless. Those stupid NFT pictures that were great for money laundering, a stupid JPEG worth 20k is now $5. The Sinclair C5. HTTPS forward slash forward slash en wikipedia org wiki Sinclair underscore C5. Olestra, the fat substitute, it was supposed to be revolutionary, and they came out with WoW, Doritos and Lay's chips, but then everyone started having GI issues and the chips disappeared. Not sure if it's a big thing or a trend, but when I was a kid, I vividly recall Heli's being the must-have as they would change the way that shoes worked and all that nonsense, died out in a few months. Scaled up noise cancelling technology. Web van. I landed in Silicon Valley amid the burning embers of dot-com meltdown, can never forget it. Segways, I thought by this time everyone would have a Segway and it would be the default mode of transport. Virtual reality every time it's been promoted over the last 30 years. Batteries that charged from Wi-Fi without being on a wireless charger, there was a bunch of hype and then it never came to market. HTTPS, forward slash forward slash TechCrunch, com 2010-0113 Car Energy promises usable power generated from WIFI signals possible. Dip N Dots, the ice cream of the future. Segway, for sure. The head of the company falling off one into a river and drowning didn't help. Fidget spinners, people wouldn't STFU about them like 10 years ago. In the 90s, non-lethal weapons for police. The video recording machines and cassettes Betamax.